Good morning, Heart Rockets. Buenos dias. How are all my cool cats and cool kitties? I heard that's popular. Or my cool rockets. Hey guys, so today is March the 24th, 2021. Ooh, let me see. Miss Fuentes helped me figure out that there is 49 more days that we need to come to school, to campus. Um, sounds like a lot of days, but actually it's very little. So we have to have to continue working hard for these last 49 to 50 days so we can make sure we finish off the year on a good, strong note. Look at your teachers. Yeah, they're cracking a smile because they like hearing 49. All right, guys, let's get started with our day. So again, today's uh, Wednesday, March 24th, and we are going to start off our announcements by reciting the pledge to the American flag followed by the pledge to the Texas flag. And as always, my trusty flags are still here. They're making it through the year. Well, we got 49 more days. Awesome, dude, it's gonna be awesome. You see, they're excited. All right, guys, here we go. Hands over your heart. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Juro lealtad a la bandera de los Estados Unidos de América y a la República que representa una nación bajo Dios, indivisible, con libertad y justicia para todos. Awesome, awesome, Heart Rockets. Now, let's do our pledge to the Texas flag. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. Te honro bandera de Texas. Te juro lealtad a ti, Texas, un estado bajo Dios, uno y indivisible. All right. Hey, quick uh, fun fact. Texas, or Texas, but in Spanish, Texas, T-E-J-A-S, Texas, means friendship. It means friendship, guys. I'm going to quiz you when I go into your classrooms. 100 bonus points to whoever gets and remembers that. All right, guys, I got to put the flags away, you know, because they're very special. All right, guys, so a few announcements here. Let me see Mr. Martinez with his report. All right, so EFK, our newest virtue, virtue is compassion. Compassion is giving to someone who is in need, caring for someone else, and being kind and generous to others. Hmm. Mr. Martinez went to the store yesterday and saw a lady struggling to put her groceries away, and Mr. Martinez helped her pick up um, the heavy detergent and put her cart away. I think that was very compassionate of me. So EFK award, I wanna see some compassion from you guys. All right guys, so today we're going to focus on some ways that you may give someone in need. Can you think of some people in your life that need help? What are some things that you can help with? Like Mr. Martinez example. Let's start with at home. Does your mom or dad need help with the laundry or washing the dishes? Yes, they do. Those things may not seem like much, but they make a huge difference when you help them out. It gives your parents time to focus, breathe. Amongst other things, they can do other things that they need to do. Now, think about someone outside of your home that, might, that may need help or may be in need. Talk to your parents about who you can help, those in need, and what we can do. Guys, if you... Um, a big thing that I know helps your parents is waking up every day, you know, brushing your teeth, getting ready, getting your stuff together to come to school, maybe making your bed before you go. And that's a lot for your parents. Trust me. I have three kids of my own and I can't wait until they make their own beds. All right, guys, a little uh, history. Today in 1883, long time ago, the first telephone call between New York and Chicago took place. Yeah, guys, there was no cell phones in 1883. 1920, the first U.S. Coast Guard air station was established in Moorhead City, North Carolina. 
And in 1955, the first oil drill, oh, 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 the first oil drill. That's all we have. I'm going to come back to you with that. All right, guys. So those are our fun facts of the day and our history facts. I'm pretty sure Mr. Martinez is missing a little something, but we're just going to have to proceed. All right, guys. So one more announcement. Uh, we really, um, the teachers on the YouTube link um, at the bottom, there's a description um, and the link that Ms. Dejo has put. It's a uh, www.loom.com slash share slash CE 867, et cetera, et cetera. And it is a video to check out our Hot Rocket t-shirt fundraiser that's coming up from March 24th to April the 7th. So it will start tomorrow. Make sure you listen to that video. Make sure you get your t-shirt. Mr. Martinez is going to get one. And I hope that you guys are able to get one too. It's only going to help our school out in the future. So just be looking out for that video. All right, guys, so let's let's finish off our announcements. I know they're a little long. Apologies to the teacher. Mr. Martinez is just a little crazy today, but that's okay. You guys know me. All right, guys, EAFK -E pledge. Let's proceed with our four-way test of the things we think, say, or do. We ask ourselves, is it the truth? Is it fair to all concerned? Will it build goodwill and better friendships? Will it be beneficial to all concerned? Great job, Heart Rockets. All right, so last but not least, it's important to be successful. So we're going to do our Heart Rocket Pledge, and I don't need this. So Mr. Martinez is going to say, being a Heart Rocket means that I am responsible, on task, cooperative, kind, enthusiastic, and a team worker who's successful at everything we do. One uh, shout out to Ms. Ayala's classroom. They wanted me to talk about pugs. I just think pugs are cool. Uh, other dogs are cool too, but pugs. All right, guys, you guys have a great day. Thank you for your time. Have an awesome, awesome Wednesday.